Scientists Tessa Wernstrom of the University of Western Australia and Christopher Risley of the University of Bologna, Italy, discovered three large objects that emit low-frequency radio waves, in a cluster of galaxies about 800 million light-years away. And they seem to defy the laws of physics. Galaxy clusters are huge cosmic structures that can consist of hundreds or even thousands of galaxies. But galaxies themselves occupy only a small fraction of such structures, the rest of the cluster mass is represented by mysterious dark matter as a very hot gas, which can reach temperatures of 10 million degrees Celsius. Using radio telescopes and X-ray telescopes, scientists investigated the Abel 3266 cluster of galaxies, which is about 800 million light-years away. Within this cluster, they discovered three very rare large objects that emit radio waves, a radio fossil, a radio relic, and a radio halo. Radioliquia is an arc-shaped radio source located on the fringes of a cluster of galaxies. Radiogalo is a radio source that is located closer to the center of the galaxy cluster. Like radials, these objects arise from collisions of galaxy clusters. Fossil radio emission arises after the death of a supermassive black hole in the center of the radio galaxy. Scientists have assumed for several years that all three very rare objects that emit radio waves could be found in the Abel 3266 galaxy cluster. But these three radio sources were too faint to be detected, but the scientists succeeded. The researchers also found remnants of a supermassive black hole in the galaxy cluster. The radio reliquia that scientists found in the Abel 3266 cluster of galaxies particularly interested them because it was unlike any radio object scientists had ever seen before because of its very unusual shape. The data we received doesn't quite match our understanding of how such objects are created, which we found in this cluster of galaxies. Our best physical models just can't match this data. This means that very different physics may have been involved in the creation of these objects. We got a lot of new information, but we also got even more unanswered questions, the scientist said.